Hey, good morning, how do you do? We've got something special for you. It's just no fun, it's just no kids. It's time for the safety touching. Dun, dun, dun. Wow, look at this background, Paulie. Look oh, at you guys. Yeah, Wowie. Nice. All right, time for another six at six, Patrick. Number six, there are a lot of butter alternatives out there, especially nut-based butters. Mm. Here's the latest one, it's seed-based. Roasted watermelon seed butter from eight acres. It's made from roasted watermelon seeds, and the makers say it offers an intriguing new taste. It claims to have a subtle, sweet flavor right. that you can spread on toast or apples or, or really uh, anywhere you would use regular oh, that's butter. nice. If you yeah. like seed-based butters, this might just be the thing for you. All right. Um, but, you know, I'm always a little leery of something whose tagline is intriguing new taste. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Right? Not exactly It looks a little runny sounding. for butter, doesn't it? Yeah. All right, number five. You're at the Jewels and you run into someone you haven't seen in a while. Then right. come the magic words, we need to catch up soon. Oh, no, we don't. Well, you won't see them again. The phrase we need to catch up is one of the number one little white lies people like to use. It's harmless, but it's also convenient. Yeah. It's just a more polite way of getting out of something. If yeah. you really want to see that person again, you'd make legitimate plans. Yeah. All right. So is this story just based on our writer's opinion? Because yeah. I didn't hear like, according to meeting yeah. up scientists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not to be anecdotal. Yeah, yeah. But it's but very it's, true. It's accurate it's also. Accurate. Yeah, I've used yeah. that blow off many times. Yes. Yeah, I trust Anne Marie. Yeah. She knows what she's talking about. We need to get together soon. <laughs> we need to catch up. <laughs> Four of us should go have lunch. Yeah, we really should. Yeah. It's been too, it's yeah. been too long. Yeah, it yeah. It's been too long. Yeah, someone reach out to us and organize that. Time for number four. Have you heard of the tongue-eating louse? Oh, boy. Now, listen to this. It's a fish parasite that sounds like something <gasps> out of a horror film. Oh. The name fits it well. A tongue-eating louse will devour a fish's tongue by sucking all the blood out wow. of the tongue until it falls out. And then it settles into the fish's mouth and acts as the Whoa. fish's tongue. Ugh. It's more graphic than that. Uh, we're going to leave it out, though, because it's a little disgusting. Anyhow, oh, man. according to fish scientists, it's the only parasite that can replace a host's organ. Wow. Wildlife so experts So there are say, other organs it can replace? Like I, yeah, heart or I lungs think so, or? yeah. Wildlife experts wow. say it can be quite shocking to catch a fish to open its mouth and then see another set of eyeballs oh. peering right back at you like your neck. I think it's alien. Mm, right. I didn't know fish had tongues. I didn't know. Hmm. Nature. Not normally looking in there, but. You'd think they'd have a lot more to say. With you would. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's a good point, Larry. Yeah, you're so they smart, They need to spend Larry. more time out of the water. <laughs> right. They need to be doing uh, Number three, it's almost lefse season. All right. A popular Norwegian dish that's traditionally served between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Lefse is a soft flatbread made with potatoes, flour, butter, milk, and cream or lard. Mm, I love that lard. Delicious. There are various ways to serve it with butter and sugar, or you can make it a more savory dish with salmon oh, and onions on top. Uh, oh, on top of that lard. <laughs> oh, yeah. man. This has Paul Conrad written yeah. all over Old it. Salmon lard sandwich there. <laughs> Sign me up. All right, number two, here's an idea that never quite made it to the automotive market. In 1965, Ford introduced the wrist twist steering wheel. <laughs> Look at this. The car had a roomier cabin, had a special steering yes, wheel. Yes, for uh, ladies, easier to steer <laughs> with their gentle limbs. People to drive with their arms on armrests because they're tired. The ladies are tired. Yeah. Ford even did a commercial saying it was so easy even a woman can do it. Uh, uh, <laughs> see, I told you. The armrest cars have never went beyond the testing stage. Uh, when after a women series couldn't of figure it out. <laughs> After a series of tests, it was clear that people Look how happy need their she looks. they need their hands on steering wheels for lots of reasons, yeah. mainly to control the car. Yeah, yeah we don't need Look ladies out this. there trying to control with one hand. Uh, so what makes that easier than going like this? Well, it wasn't the smaller wheel <laughs> for her delicate hands. Smaller hands, right? Yeah. All right, uh. number one. Here's something that can come in handy: the 30-second dance party button. Uh, check it out; it's available online. Just Google it. Here we go. 30 second dance party.
This is how we party. We don't even have time for the full 30 seconds. You yeah. get the idea. Mm. Boy, that's fun. Maybe they should just keep it to 15. <laughs> 15 is plenty. <laughs> All right. Got the weather there, Paulie. Yeah.